Imagine this, a patient in a rural town gets a diagnosis more accurate than what they'd receive in a top-tier city hospital. A physician finishes notes before leaving the exam room. And a nurse's shift ends on time because virtual assistants handled all the routine calls. This is not science fiction. It's the reality of healthcare AI and virtual staffing today. Stay with me as we uncover how these tools are shaping the future of medicine. Artificial intelligence is no longer a side experiment. It's integrated into daily workflows. AI predicts complications like acute kidney injury hours before labs confirm it. In family medicine, AI can listen for subtle speech changes that suggest depression or early dementia. Emergency departments are already using AI to prioritize triage by predicting which patients are likely to deteriorate. These tools give clinicians superpowers, helping them intervene earlier and with greater accuracy. Microsoft's Diagnostic Orchestrator scored 85.5% on tough New England Journal of Medicine cases, four times better than experienced physicians under trial conditions. In the real world, AI is spotting rare autoimmune conditions that even specialists sometimes miss. Radiology AI is flagging strokes on CT scans before the radiologist reads them. And in oncology, AI systems are analyzing pathology slides to catch microscopic cancer clusters that humans might overlook. The result? Faster, safer, more confident decision-making. AI scribes are quietly revolutionizing practice. Ambient's healthcare automatically generates soap bite notes during patient visits. Nuance's Dragon Ambient Experience, now used by Mayo Clinic and Cleveland Clinic, listens in real time and produces full encounter documentation. Augmedix, widely adopted in family medicine and urgent care clinics, turns conversations into structured EHR notes within minutes. Some health systems report reducing after hours charting, so-called pajama time, by more than 70%. That means more family dinners for clinicians and more face-to-face -face time with patients. Staffing shortages are everywhere, and AI is helping hospitals get ahead. In Connecticut, AI forecasts ER surges using weather and flu data so hospitals add staff before storms. In ICUs, predictive models anticipate bed demand after large community events. Some systems are using AI to match patient acuity with nurse experience levels, reducing burnout and improving outcomes. Scheduling software even suggests shift swaps that prevent excessive overtime, improving retention. Virtual nursing is becoming a lifeline. A heart failure patient discharged home receives a daily call from a virtual nurse who reviews medications and weight changes, preventing readmissions. A diabetic sends blood sugar readings via an AI assistant that escalates abnormal trends to the care team. Teladoc's AI agents triage late night calls, routing urgent chest pain to an on-call physician immediately while reassuring non-urgent cases. These solutions reduce dependence on costly travel nurses while improving patient safety. AI is reimagining how patients engage between visits. Ellipsis Health Sage checks on pain control and adherence after surgery, escalating concerns to a nurse. An asthma patient receives personalized text reminders on days when pollen counts are high. In mental health, chatbots provide daily mood check-ins and immediately alert a counselor if suicide risk appears. Virtual assistants like Sully.ai help patients complete intake forms, flag allergies, and draft preliminary treatment notes so physicians can enter the visit fully prepared. AI is setting new standards in diagnostics and monitoring. Radiology systems are detecting 5 millimeter lung nodules that might be overlooked in routine scans. Wearables detect atrial fibrillation, sending real-time alerts to cardiologists. Remote patient monitoring programs track oxygen in COPD patients, preventing unnecessary hospitalizations. In diabetes care, sick AI-driven RPMs reduce medication errors by 30%. These aren't future pilots. They're already deployed in leading health systems. Virtual staffing fills gaps, but also sparks debate. Remote nurses now supervise dozens of telemetry patients across states, while remote scribes document visits nationwide. Yet unions caution against replacing bedside staff with automation, warning of false alarms and depersonalization. The path forward is balance. Let AI and virtual staff manage routine tasks, freeing human clinicians to focus on complex care, empathy, and the healing touch only people can provide. Four major trends will shape the next decade of care delivery. 
First, generative AI assistants are drafting discharge plans and summarizing clinical notes. Second, big tech, Microsoft, Google, Amazon, and NVIDIA are investing billions into AI healthcare platforms. Third, Access is expanding. AI-enabled mobile apps are delivering diagnostic support to rural clinics in Africa and Asia. And fourth, new ethical frameworks are emerging to safeguard privacy, accountability, and fairness in AI. The future of healthcare is not about machines replacing clinicians, it's about partnership. Picture a physician reviewing a care plan with AI-generated insights or a nurse supported by a virtual assistant who manages routine follow-ups. AI and virtual staffing are creating a system that is more proactive, more personalized, and more accessible than ever before. The question is, will you be ready to practice in this new hybrid world of humans and AI? If you found this helpful, please like this video, share it with colleagues, and subscribe for more insights on how AI is transforming healthcare. Together, let's prepare for the future of medicine.